Master Chan Chan Chan, Stan Tuncho here. Welcome back to another episode of the Pokemon Scorch Silver Nuzlocke. In the last episode, we went through the Dragon's Den. We failed the Dragon's Den, sadly. I'm going to go and try to do that again some other, uh, some other day with save states and stuff like that. Trying to figure out if I can get that extreme speed Dragonite or whatever I get in this game. Anyway, uh, We'll do that off screen. Uh, I also went through Route 27 and the Tocho Falls on our way to the Pokemon League. We're in Route 26 now. Let's see where we can go from here. We also can get a new encounter, so we should definitely do that. Off screen, I did heal, I did buy more potions. So that's. Good. Uh, that's a Shin Ninja. Wheels. I don't like the Phantom Force, I will admit. And the fact that Wheels is faster than a Shin Ninja is weird too. But kill it, please, wheels. I mean, anything would kill it. Because it's only got one HP. What's next? Cleavor! Well, that's something a cool tech can take down. Right? I mean, I live... And you die! And a fortress. Uh, that is Wheels territory. Magnet rise. Okay, so you're not into ground, but you're still very weak to fire. So, fire it is. And sturdy. Kind of annoying, but I'm okay with it. Is that cannon? That's going to paralyze me because that's what it does. Okay. Uh, smack down. I can live another zap cannon. And if I... Hit, I will kill. It's just a question of whether I hit, so... It is inevitable, so that's why I sped up. Okay, well that's clearly a bush. That's a Venomoth. Uh, wheels? And a stunt tank. Uh, what do I do against that? Let's try and get this. My encounter for Route 26 is a Rapidash. I always seem to run into Rapidash here. Doesn't matter what version of the game I'm playing, always Route 26, Rapidash. Uh, well, I'm going to take this opportunity to 
uh, heal wheels. Because I don't think it can kill me. It's Rapidash. And as long as I keep an eye on HP. Oh, I press Surf. Damn it. Okay, I deserve that. Yeah, I deserve that. I, I fudged up. I pressed surf. Okay, cool. Viker fault down. What is next? Brave Bree. Well, you also don't like rocks. Oh, okay, who's coming out? Batty! Mm, I mean, Batty can do this, Psychic. Nice work, Batty. And a Blissey. Well, practically everything is uh, not very effective here with Batty, so I'm going to go into something that can hit you physically. Albert. Nice. What is up here? Can I avoid you? I can avoid you. And I'm not falling for that. I'm not falling for that. I don't fall for your double battle tactics game. Because I'm smart. Don't like the swagger. That's going to be annoying to deal with. I said when my attack stat is actually pretty good. Brave Bird. I resist that. And that hurts you, plus recall. Wheels. Wheels fights through. Okay, what is next? And your final Pokemon is a Aerodactyl. Uh, I mean, if if I can get a cool turn to in, I can kill this. It's just getting a cool turn to in. And then surfing the level, the ever lying daylights out of it. In your own time, a cool tent. Thank you. Although I can't believe he just kept on iron heading me for some reason. You know. Aerodactyl learns Earthquake and would be very, very annoying if it decided to, I don't know, use Earthquake and kill a cool tent. Why 
What's in the house? Uh, I'm gonna rely on your speed here to kill the sand slash. Nice. Good work, a cool tent. And a Mudsdale. I mean, you probably could kill that too. But I better not risk it, Polly. Yeah, that's why I better not risk it. I need to get Surf off you because you are better with Waterfall. Yeah, so I need to remember where the move to leader is in this game, and then uh, the uh, Poly Surf before the Pokemon League. Ooh. Hello. My, my, my. Your Pokemon could do the rest. Would you like a rest? I would like a rest. Thank you. I will very much accept a rest. And I will keep continue to visit you because you're awesome. I always lived here with my grandma. She taught me so much. Uh, she taught me as much as she could. You can have this, a salak berry. Nice. Cool. Zatu. Uh, what do I do against Zadu? Uh, wheels. Wheels. That's what we do against Zadu. Wheels. Uh, let's rock slide. Oh. Okay. Smart. Slight problem though. If I bring in Polly, I'm gonna have to watch out for that future site. Okay, I'm gonna have to watch out for that future site. Here comes the future site. Uh, I mean, I took that, but... Ow! I live in Earth Power. And prison doesn't really do anything to me because I don't know any moves that you don't know. Oh, I know any. Mo I don't know any moves that you know. Sorry, got that the wrong way around. Okay, I need to go back into wheels. But, I mean, I could ice beam you, but I'd be also risking power swap. Oh, that's not. Is that good or bad? It doesn't matter. Uh, 
I already got my encounter. Oh. Okay, so I do have to... Uh, I do have to go through that... Uh, go off that ledge in order to get back. I don't have anything that deals with you. Except for just, I guess, power? Ah, so the days of the week house is not here. You know, the special items. If you find certain people during the day. That house is not here. What do I do against you? And I guess I'll slowly trip away at you and just hope for no baneful bunkers. I can live on the quotation. I can live with the quotation. And the heel house is just up here anyway, so I should be fine. Famous last words. Crusto. I mean, I might take this time to actually heal. Oh no! <gasps> I lived an EQ! Uh, what do I do? Polly? I need to live. Okay. Steady. Oh, you only hit twice. Cool. Okay, this is so scary, Pokemon. But I'm okay. Rapidash. Oh, no. Okay. Uh, wheels? This guy is a fighting type move. Uh, of a flying type move, and was trying, and was going to kill Polly. You have high horsepower. <gasps> I live. I was about. I was almost thinking in my head that was the end of wheels. But... 
I am thankful it's also not the end of wheels. Samaconda. Okay, sand split's going to be annoying to deal with. Dig Dug Trio! Ah! I did not realise this thing could learn Aerial Ace! Okay. When the worst thing comes... I can always run back to a heel house. What do I do against a Gliscor? Cross scissor? Really? Okay. I was thinking flying move, but he didn't do flying move. Heel house is just here. Very helpful. Gonna be very helpful in grinding too if I need to uh, get ready for that Elite Four. Especially if I can find Lucky Egg. Uh... Yeah, especially if I can find the Gibble in the Dragon's Den. Because Gibble gives off Lucky Eggs, as I've said. Problem is, I don't have thief, so I'm gonna have to uh, basically just keep catching gibbles until I find one with a lucky egg. Plus, I don't know, it could be like a 5% thing. So, it could be a while before I find my gibble. And I don't have thing, I don't have a thing that, well, I could do the compound air strategy. That is a thing I could do. I could do compound eyes. I could go and catch a. Uh... I could go and catch a uh, canopy, fight, evolve it into a butterfree, and then basically uh, use compound eyes to try and find what I'm actually looking for. Because if you use compa compound eyes, basically, well, it ups the chance of you finding a uh, an item on a Pokemon. So, yeah, I might do that. But then again, I don't know how rare a gibbles are, gibbles are. I just know that gibbles can be found there. I don't know exactly how rare they are. Okay, Hatterene. Uh, 
What do we do? I mean, wheels is good for this. And we, oh, that actually works out nicely. Do that. And kill it, please. Because it did try and calm mine on me. Ooh. Uh, hi, Shane. I'm going to go run and heal. Bef Actually, wait. I can just go and see what these items are first. A hyper potion. Nice. And we'll fight you. Torterra. Uh, what do I do against Torterra? Baddy, baddy, baddy. Oh no, buddy! Like I didn't think it'd have crunch. You resist. Leaf storm should do nothing. I'm kind of waiting on the earthquake though. I will admit, because that is gonna be like Wheels' downfall. Or we just one shot with a flamethrower, that's always cool. And your final Pokemon is a Nido Ke Nido Queen. Uh, Polly. Chip away. Uh, surf. Superpower. I live that, right? Yeah, I beast that. Another surf should kill. Nice, level 71. Uh, let me run back and heal before facing Shane. And let me also try and sort this green screen. This is kind of annoying because I could either have a little bit of phasing on me or the green screen phasing. I'm going to choose a I'm going to choose the green screen phasing, but just hope that it doesn't look as bad as I think it does because maybe I can turn too much lighting.
Why? Why is there so much artifacting on this video? I mean, it's quite. I've turned the ring light on full right now, which is really bright. <laughs> but. I think that might do it. I think it's just because I'm wearing a brown shirt and brown is sort of green. So, yeah, it's going to do that. Anyway. Almost there now. May if I can't beat him, maybe he'll uh, finally leave the Super Pokemon League and come home. If I can beat him, he'll leave the Super Pokemon League and come home. But am I really strong enough? Joanne! How long have you been standing there, you little creep? Well, never mind. Okay, yeah, too much, not enough light. Yeah, that's what it is. It's not enough light. I could probably open some windows, but... Well, I suppose you're off to the Pokemon League as well. Look, I'll admit that you may have gotten a little better lately, although I definitely did uh, most of the work against uh, those Team Chicken Freak... Uh, jerks. Say, I could use a little warm-up before the league. Come on. I still need to get back at you for uh, what happened in C for that battle in Seanwood. All right. Uh, go Vantua to start. Wheels, you're up. How? I mean, life or thunder? Okay. Still, how are you hitting these thunders? You hit two in a row. Okay, go eventually down. I'm going to need wheels later on, though. Polly. Okay, Polly is going to do damage. Uh, submission would be nice, but I'm going to surf because... Grass Knot! I mean, I live that. I beast that, actually, but wasn't expecting that. Okay, Crocs down. You can learn Earthquake, right? I 
Ow! I mean, if I could get wheels, if I could get Polly in, I could probably take this guy out. But it's a question of if I can get Polly in. Okay, I live that. Speed boost is annoying, but I can handle that. Uh, let me heal. Thank you for the water absorb. Okay. Now I'm gonna now I'm gonna make you submit. Or not because um no. You protected. Your crunch does nothing to me. Now I'm gonna make you submit. Beautiful. Oh, he hung on with a focus sash. And I think I could live another attack. Strength? Wow, I do nice damage for strength. I don't really need to do what I'm playing. Okay, that took a lot of damage. Muck. I don't really have anything that deals with muck. Especially not in this form, in its Kentorian form. I could probably handle it with Batty. But in this form, being Poison Dark, I need wheels. But I need to get wheels in. Full restore. I do, I have one. HP fighting. Does absolutely nothing to me. And you don't like it when I throw rocks at you. Alright, so all that's left to do is take down this muck. Eventually, I can do that. Uh, 
Ooh, flame body, nice. But also poison touch, bad. I love a gunk shot, right? Oh yeah, I beast that. You're just lucky. Don't let it get to your head. You may have beaten me, but I can guarantee it won't happen again. I just need to change up my strategy a little bit. And uh, you'll have no chance. I'm pretty much ready to take care of Dad, too. Just watch. I'll beat him before you even make it out of Victory Road. Later, loser. I mean, I'm going to uh, run back to the heel house and end this episode there. And we'll go through Victory Road in the next episode. That sounds like a good plan. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Of course, follow me on Twitter. I'm Atlanta Joe. I'm also at Lantern Show on Threads, on Blue Sky, on Mastodon, and Lantern Joe everywhere. So follow me over the all over on the social uh, networking sites whilst I uh, move off Twitter uh, over the uh, next couple of months towards the end of 2024. Uh, I'm probably going to delete my uh, Twitter in 2025. That's probably one of the things I want to do in 2025 for the YouTube channel. That's one of my New Year's resolutions for the YouTube channel. Delete my Twitter. But uh, for real life, I've got other ones that you guys aren't really important. Well, they aren't really important to YouTube, but for me, I want to travel more. So that is something Lantern Joe c can do. Uh, so I'm going to do that. That is something I need to plan for. So there's plenty of places I want to go and visit in the world. The world is... Where I want to go and visit. And I want to make vlogs doing it. So that might happen. And of course also I would like to mask a lot. You know I have autism. And crowds scare me and stuff like that. So I need to figure out ways to be able to adapt to my environments and be myself. So that I can be... So it's less exhausting when I'm out in crowds and socialising and stuff like that. Because... It's exhausting doing all that, being autistic and all that. But if I can learn to mask less and be more Joe, then maybe I don't have to worry about how exhausting socialising is? We'll see. Anyway, until next time, I'm Lancer and Joe. Me to the Pokemon get to us, uh, everybody get Pokemon. Good night! Thank you so much for watching. If you did enjoy this video, then please consider leaving a like, comment, and subscribing for more videos. And of course, if you ring the bell, you'll be notified first when those videos come out. You can follow me on Twitter at Lantern Joe, where you'll get news, thoughts, and opinions from me and the rest of the Lantern Nation. And of course, if you want to watch some more videos, there should be something in the top right and top left hand corner of this here end card. But until next time, I have been Lantern Joe and I'll see you on the next video.